what's guys and welcome back to skull and bones we are back at it and to honestly things are not looking good for skurlock and the gang so last episode we were supposed to be hitting a french convoy turns out that was a trap we were able to take him out, but uh, the French were on the move, and we got to react. The Farrah yeah. Company partnership threatened Skurlock's trade operations in the Red Isle, plunder a Farrah settlement while flying company colors to sour relations. The I love this. Ye, the snobs delude themselves by playing a puppet master, pulling strings to get me trapped. It's a good idea. I say... We entangle the French in their own rigging. Turn the fire on them before they come for us. All right. Plunder the fire and blame the French. Your devious mind is why I keep you around. But I'm way ahead of you, Cully. My agents will plant rumors of French treachery, and you, Cully, will play the villain. Perfect. This is some pirate shiz. Plunder the para, and we'll blame it on the compagnie. You dress the part if you want. <laughs> Karadek will be too busy quelling the Farah rebellion to come for us. Besides, turning Farah trade our way has always been the plan. Without French weaponry, they'll need us. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Here we go. Delicate alliance. So we're going to dress up as company, the, the blue and yellow, and we're going to go attack a, a Farah fortress. And I don't know, we're, we're kind of small in the grand scheme of things right now. So we're going to get the two powerhouses around us riled up fighting against each other. And we should be able to make out on both ends. So this should be good. So we're going to our ship here. We should be able to change up the cosmetics. We're going to go for the, uh, the company cosmetic set. So let's go ahead and apply everything we can probably want to change sail colors we're gonna put that there do we want to change the hull i feel like our hull is a little bit dark we probably don't have to to be honest but i feel like this looks pretty good it's gonna cost us 1500 let's buy and equip it why not let's play the whole part here all right we've even got company fireworks dude the florida lease so we'll throw this up there just gonna leave all the traces of company behind all right, and then I'm assuming we're gonna go attack them over here. We're gonna take on this Tanyona, Tan Tanjona port. This is dirty, I love this. This is real pirate activity right now. We are getting down and dirty. You can't beat them, join them in a way. Dark and stormy night ahead of us, but we're gonna use that to our advantage and Plunder our first major base. I am a little bit worried. What level are we looking at? This is a level four guard tower, level three settlement. Okay. We haven't taken down a tower yet. Those are these guys here. So we're going to have to take that down. We have the bombard cannons now that we unlocked in the last episode. New ship and everything. Yeah, we're, we're going to be in good shape. I think we're well prepared for this. Hopefully it won't be too hard. Going to try to keep a low profile. Along the way, don't want to start any problems, so let's just stay out of the way of these guys. How you doing, fellow company ship? I think, maybe. Let's not hit them, let's just ride by. You know what, just kidding, these aren't company guys, so we're... We're gonna take them on. Let me, let me grab their stuff really quick. Come on, one more hit, we should be able to board them. Crew boarding, easy peasy. Just like that. These are sea people. I mean, honestly, we like the sea people, but we're pirates, so we don't. Do we really like anybody? No, not really. We'll take your uncut garnets and your cast iron ingots, and we'll get the heck out of here. All right. So we're gonna sail through, go south. There's our objective. More bronze ingots here. I mean, I'm always down. Hit him with a couple of those. Couple of these. They're done. Hit him again. Hit him again. There it is. That's what I'm talking about. Slow things down. Let's grab all that loot. I like the bronze ingots. Honestly, those are a little bit harder to come by. So just quick smash and dashes. We're good to go. Is that? That's that's Fada. Okay. It's actually not the best idea that we did that, but we're going to be fun. As long as we get out of dodge, we don't want to start a fight here. These are the guys that we're trying to side with, so we probably shouldn't be attacking them like we are. Keep an eye on them there. We're okay. We'll just keep a low profile over here. Harvest some Oroko wood. As they search for us, looks like they lost us. And we are back to neutral. All day, baby. 
I mean, technically, th these are the, like, as, as Skurlock and the pirates, we want to side with the Fada clan here. Technically, if, if we're flying the company colors, we're actually doing ourselves a favor by attacking their ships and things, but let's focus on the task at hand. We got to round this bend and fight and pillage. We have a big shipwreck here. I didn't think we were going to have access to this, but we got some frankincense. Interesting. Not bad. There is some jeet or whatever it's called over here. Jute, that's what it is. That's what this game is all about, man. You gotta you gotta take the opportunities when you can. I think I might start doing some more grinding off screen just to, to get all these materials so we don't have to do this in the middle of episodes, but it's kind of satisfying to hit all your marks. Dude, there's something about this. Sailing into the unknown, into the abyss, into the storm. Got lightning off in the distance, and our crew is just yelling and having a great time. We're almost there. I don't even know what they're talking about. Love watching the water come into the ship there. Splashing up near the cannons as it goes over the, the walls. Now, I am a little bit worried about this. I'm hoping, I mean, maybe we could have some help. We've got rules 11, rules 11 off to the right. He might be on the same mission as us. We'll see what happens, but uh, these are where it gets intense. So these pillaging missions, sail towards the settlement and hold Y to start a plunder. These plundering missions, it's just, you know, you got to fight the things on land. You got to fight the boats coming in. You got to try to stay alive. It looks like Rulesy might, might be going after the same thing. So that'd be kind of fortunate if he was, but this is our next objective. Go ahead and have a meal before we get into it, and it's time to start this plunder, baby. Off with their heads! So I think we're gonna take this tower out first. I'm assuming this is... We'll wanna use this. Oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, I'm just gonna pretty much explicitly focus on this as much as we can. We're doing some decent damage with our bombard cannons. We're also setting it on fire, which is always helpful. It's oh, there's a ship behind us. Yeah, so let's let's finish this first, and then we'll take on that ship. We could turn and hit the ship with our our shotgun shells. Come on, there it is. Turn back. Hit the rest of this tower. Turn this way. Our shotgun shells are definitely the the worst thing that we have. Got them there. We got some loot. We're good. We want to get up close, close with these guys. There it is. Fire some muskets at them. Love to see that. I don't know how we got that ability, but it must be with the ship or something. Got some there. Got more guys here. Come on, get it in there. I'm gonna use a repair kit. Let's hit them here. So we've got two ships on us right now. There's one down. Take the loot. Here's a second one down right now. Could have done a crew boarding, but we're good to go. Have more loot over here. Looks like we have beautiful. He joined our plunder. We'll take that all day. Thank you. Are we supposed to be hitting like the walls and stuff? I don't think so. I think we focus on the ships right now. They're coming in hot. Watch out, bro. Got a piece. Got a good piece right there. That's what I'm talking about. Hit him on the side. They're done. Leveled up to Buccaneer, we'll take it. Got some more loot. Let me try. Can we hit him? A little short. Another one coming in here. Gotta aim low-ish to try to hit that special spot. Here we go. That's gonna be a big one. He's done. Are we supposed to be shooting the, I, I know if they have towers, but there are no towers for us to take out right now. So I think they're gonna keep sending reinforcements. From the sea. Looks like we've got another one coming in right here. From downtown. That should hit. Let's go! On the move, too. Just a, a beauty here. Try to come up alongside. Hit him in that weak spot. Hit him with the crew boarding. A little too high there. Got him. Night, night. Not too shabby. We'll take all the bonuses we can. Got another healing kit, but honestly, with this ship that heals itself, we don't even really have to worry about that, dude. This is, this is perfect. I love this ship. This is my favorite one yet. Obviously, could do a little bit more damage or sail a little bit faster, but the fact that we can just fight and not worry about healing as much is pretty nice. 
We've got one more wave to survive here. I can't tell if we're supposed to shoot stuff. He's shooting stuff in there, so I'm just gonna keep shooting stuff. Oh, we are. We're in increasing the... Every time we shoot, we increase that yellow bar. We're not doing a lot of damage with our side cannons, our short, like, shotgun things here, but we can use this. That should help quite a bit. There it is. All right. Plunder completed. It is a pleasure doing business. Klein, thank you for your help, my man. That's how we get it done. Got to take this good news back to Skurlock, and I'm sure he's going to be stoked. Got another one here. I'll just take you down really quick. Ridiculous, dude. Just tag team. Climb, my man. Thank you for helping, brother. You're, you're the man. All right. We want to take a left here, and we're going to head back home. I'm going to see if we can't force this open yet, though. Unavailable. Oh, that's. I think that's because he's doing it. Just a couple of buds with the same ideas. Klein, you have a good day, my man. I appreciate you. Big time. Can we take a look at this? I feel like some of these bigger ones take level three. Or we may have already done it in the past. I don't see an option. Okay. Let's head home. This is where the ship really signs though. So we, we had some damage back there. I also just took down a couple other ships on our way home and that tower is still firing at us. I don't think he's going to be up. Uh, nope. Can't hit us again. But look at this. Like we're, we're really not doing well. We've got some tattered sails. We were at about half health. But by the time we get home, because we have that perk of, of healing 0.5 per second or per, per five seconds or something like that. I mean, slowly but surely, we're just going to mend ourselves, so. We can get into battle, we can take what we want, we can pillage and plunder, and then we can leave. And it doesn't take us any resources to be back brand new again the next time we need it. I mean, look at this, back to 100% health, and we aren't even through the creek here, so. Yeah, this, this is OP. I, I couldn't recommend this thing enough. Obviously, there are going to be better ships, stronger ships, more powerful ships in the future, but I can't imagine a better ship for... The use that we're using right now just quick smash and grabs not wasting inventory these guys are messing are these our friends they're messing with the sea people no sir do not mess with my boys i like the sea people they're probably my favorite crew that we've met thus far yeah, we'll take care of that really quick. There is no allegiance and piracy, though. I think I accidentally hit their fortress a little bit there, and they're they're now attacking us. You know what? We could do another pillage, but ah, screw it. We're pirates. We're doing it. You don't fire at me and get away with it. I'm sorry. So let's... Let's... Uh, are we high enough level? I hope so. Guard tower. Foundry level three. Cast iron ingots. I mean, this is... This is going to be good money for us. Here we go. Money shot right off the rip. Starting up another plunder, why not? I feel bad, I actually do like the sea people, but I was trying to save them, they shot at me first. It is what it is. We're gonna take down this tower first and then we start taking on the rest of the fort. Oh shoot. We kind of put ourselves in a bad spot here with this rock, but we'll make it work. I want something that lets us reload these bombards quicker. These are so good. Look at the, the fire, we can just let the fire do it. I'm gonna save them. It didn't quite kill him off. They put it out. That's unfortunate. All right, they're down there. So now I think we just kind of want to fire at the thing. Again, we don't have the ideal setup with these like shotgun style things, but we're going to be okay. They're going to have people come in to try to save them. I can already see them coming. See if we can hit them from a distance. Oh, baby. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. We're going to kill him before he even gets here. Come on. There it is. Money shot. And he's dead. Oh, we missed the last one. Are you serious? He's dead. Just gonna keep firing on the, the foundry that we used to be friends with. But there are no friendships in piracy, I guess. Got another one coming in from downtown. Got him. Oh my goodness, dude. These are so good. One more hit right here. He's dead. And then we could turn and just Keep blasting away. Just need a couple more shots on their base here. We are in the final segments. Come on, let's hit them with both sides. We, we need better cannons on the side if we're gonna be doing these. Our current cannons are more for running and gunning, getting up on top of people and, and doing as much damage as quickly as possible, but it works. Just hit those there, hit this here, let them keep reloading on each other. One more hit and we should be good to go. That should be a wrap. One more enemy to take down. Where is he at? Behind us? 
That's not going to do a whole lot of damage, but this one certainly will. If we can hit that hard to hit spot. Give me this bonus right here. Oh my goodness, just devastating blows. Fire our muskets at him. Should be able to get the, the takeover here, right? Or can we not do takeovers? We might not be able to do takeovers during these. Hit that there. A couple of hits and they're done. And the Tambi Foundry is complete, baby. Back to back, really easy strongholds that we didn't really have to try that hard for, but we'll take it. Absolute heroes. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I know we're getting it done. We did level up. So that's going to open up a bunch of new options for tools and weapons and stuff for us. We're going to have to check that out. We're a buccaneer now. You've grown in disrepute like a Louisiana gator munching on idle hands. But for now, a true pirate's test. Nice. All right, got a buccaneer chest and a bunch of stuff. We'll throw this in cargo for now. Looks good. And let's go talk to our captain. El Capitan. Mr. Skurlock. The plan worked. We went in. We saw. We conquered. All under a disguise, a fake name. And the enemy of our enemy has hopefully become our friend. Attacking a sea people settlement. Do you have build sloshing between your ears? Oh, he doesn't like that I did that. <laughs> My bad, bro. Uh, Don't play coy with me, Cully. I was under... Even I heard of the ruckus you fools caused. The sea people soldiers might find you in my company. And if they do... I was under the... They'll drag us to the square and rip us to shreds. The disguise. You take what you want from the sea people. That's your affair. But I gotta deal with them. So if you don't do it quietly, I'll be forced to gut you myself. I love that the decisions you make outside of the main storyline he actually reacts to. I take what I want, man. Pirates are dead pirates. You keep this up, and they'll make sails out of your skin. The actions you are known for matter a great deal. Okay, we aren't attacking the sea people again. From the sea people, but not a soul hears of it. Pirate. <laughs> It's like a shark lurking quietly beneath the surface, striking its prey, and then returning to the depths. God, pirates are disgusting people. Now, off to the hunt with you. But what about the fact that I, I completed your contract? You can be happy now, right? This Bad news first, good news second. Has earned its color. Red in every river with that bloody show you put on. Have a swig of rum. Take it easy, Captain. Few pirates have your resolve, Cully. Most go limp with shame when playing the villain. Well, it was a pleasure. The way you stirred this piss pot to boiling, villain is in your blood. It was a good idea, sir. I respect it. The war you ignited was good, but the Isle is aflame with fighting. Chaos is bad for trade. Some of Chulin's shipments were waylaid in the crossfire. Well, never mind the cargo. You keep the fire on Karadek's tail. Leave Chulin and his dickwigs in New York to me. Beautiful. All right. Contract complete. We got a bunch of uh, notoriety for that. Looks like we have another mission here. The Farah Company Alliance threatens Skirlock's power, but could be fractured by exploiting what the Farah holds sacred. Steal Farah artifacts and supply them to corrupt company agents. So we're going to continue this. We're just igniting a flame between these two. Pitch black night, devising a plan to get the Farah as pissed off as a hen who's lost her eggs. The Farah value their safety charms. It wards off ill luck on the seas, brings fortune. Finds love, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Charms will use against them. Okay. Think you can fool them? Merchants hoping for smooth voyage will pay a fortune for them. Only difference is my French agents will be the ones selling. Dirty. Sight of the French. Making a profit off Farah of charms will sour their alliance. And I want to smell the stink of their raw impact from it. Alright. Phase two. Undercover. Making our enemies even angrier. Don't you go off half cocked. Steal the Farah charms. Let the French take the fall and hope to the heavens we're not found out. Easy peasy. 
Easy peasy, baby. I love it. All right, the crew is on board, and we are in route. We are starting down here by Fort Louise, and we are going to be going to the Southwest Passage. Seal Farah Odis and send them to the Krep Company agents at Fort Louise. Sounds good to me. Love our little cat friend, man. Look at him. He's just hanging out on his post, his little scratching tree. Dude, this ship is so sick. We've dropped the company colors. We're back to our black sails. Look at the skulls on the helm. The gold accents and things. Man, this looks insane. All right. Looks like we've got an island out here. That might be where we find them, or we might be trying to hit their trade routes. So let's see what we can find. Man, as a pirate, where would you get fresh water? Those days on the ocean when you're in the sun, you're just getting blasted by salt water and like, there is no level of exhaustion that compares to that. Is this, we're looking for the, the Odis? Fada Odi right there. All right. It's a level four too. Oh, we missed the first shot. That's something that we probably don't want to make a habit of, but we're going to be fine. Here we go. Crew boarding. I mean, we should be able to get him right. We're right here. We better not miss that. But yeah, like days on the water, especially on the ocean, lake days are, are not anywhere close to the same the salt water it just takes it out of you so i don't like how did pirates do that back in the day without unlimited access to fresh water try to take this guy down we're not really a rammer but i'll i'll take a little bit of ramming action we'll get some crew boarding going and there it is we get some more odies there cannonball crate oh we did get one all right, we got two. Now we got to deliver it back to Fort Luis. That was the easiest objective we have had yet. Is there anything else around here? I don't see anything else. All right, let's turn things around. We're going to head back towards the south. By the way, kind of exciting. While we were in there, oh, we can't see it right now. Uh, basically on our deck, we did get the, the piece of furniture that helps out with our bombard bombs. So we are the strongest we have ever been. But honestly, I think it's going to be time to upgrade here soon. I really like this ship. I think we're always going to come back to this ship. But I do kind of want to get a more offensive minded one just to test it out. We don't quite have it unlocked yet, but I got my sights on. Uh, I think next episode we're probably going to be building it. This guy right here, the Padawa Kang, everyone's talking about this. Supposed to be so good. Explosive is improved. DPS is improved. It's going to be great. We're going to be a Brigand 1, which we're getting there. We're halfway to Brigand right now. So I would think, you know, a couple more missions. And we're going to be in great shape to take that on. I don't know what these charts do. They don't... We've been collecting these for forever. Hit that, hurry up, grab it. A Soratani charts i'm not sure what they are but we've been collecting them so hopefully eventually they're going to be useful there's another one right here oh snuff interesting all right little little upper decky action here on the high seas back here to fort Luis. i'm assuming we're going to give this to the corrupt officer on sacred offerings done deal at the long gun grinder in return and we also completed a mission contract complete should give us some more notoriety a good deal for you huh not bad we'll take it all right come again let's for the red island engage in dealings with local factions it's gonna fast travel back to saint anne here let's go talk to skurlock so we've loaded the gun given it to him we took the special amulets and and you know the things that mean a lot to the feta we've given it to the Company agents, they're gonna sell it, they're gonna make them mad. It's perfect. Job well done. Easy peasy. You ready for more? Absolutely. You see the sights, Cully? Fire spears, spit roasting French corpses, wrecks clogging up the port. Just as we intended. You horn swoggled the fire like a siren with those charms. They're up in arms. Karadek's still a clueless clod. <laughs> yeah, we have them dancing on the pyre we lit. But the smoke's blowing back in our face. Oh no. Goods bound for New York never arrived. <whistles> Thought it was the French chaos that disrupted my trade. But now, I'm beginning to suspect a rat in the ranks. 
I'll find them. Shipments are gone, Cully. Not a bleeding trace of a record trade. Never you mind. My agents will find the missing cargo and hang the rat by his tail. You keep piling driftwood on the French. I want them burnt to a crisp. So we got a rat somewhere. Make this a fortune. But I guess we're not gonna be hit. I thought he was gonna have us go find the rat. Wait for Skrlock to devise a plan to recover his lost shipment, and for now we're kind of free i guess so in the meantime we have a nice mission right here thrill of the hunt hunt wildlife and collect their trophies we're gonna need to get back in our dow which is the first like little rowboat that we had we're gonna slay hammerheads nile crocs and hippos so let's change our ship i'm sad to see her go we're gonna switch back to the dow uh i'm gonna move all cargo to the new ship why not dude look at this little thing should we, do we have, we don't have any like slots or anything in there. We can manage the cosmetics, I guess. Change her up a little bit. We could put our, our set on that we like. Can we include our companion? We can. So we could put our little, little pet on here. Love it. We can put on our special fireworks and stuff. There's one figurehead you could put on here, but wrong ship size and we're not a kingpin yet. So, okay, let's, uh. Let's set sail. So we're going to take on some animals. We're going hunting. We do have the upgraded spear, which is exciting. And let's see what we can do. So we're looking, we're looking for crocs. There's a croc there. Hippos are up here. Hammerhead sharks here. Okay. So we'll go straight ahead. We'll get the crocs and then we'll go back out. We'll go up top. I love that this is going to get us a lot of infamy as well. 300 infamy for taking down a couple of animals. Oh boy. Okay. Why is a level 8 attacking us like this? What in the world? Why? Why? Alright. We're... I, I'm not ready to take that on yet. I can't take... Even if we were in our main ship. Okay, I'm in a rowboat, dude. What is happening? R Rinui, do you want to help out here? I can't even fire back. I can throw arrows at you. Or, or, or spears. Bro, what the fudge? Eat your food. Get inside the safe zone. Do not... Oh, slow it down. Good. Speed it up. Beautiful. Good dodge. Watch out for that guy. Stay... Out of all the things that we've done and all the naughty shiz that we've been into, that is where we die. Voyage ended. Sunk by the flying charge. Respawn at sea for 102 or return to St. Anne. I mean, I'll save my, my money. Do we lose anything is the question. Are they gonna make, they're gonna make fun of us, aren't they? Cargo recovery. Your cargo will be jettisoned at sea when you are defeated. Return to where you were sunk to recover it before it's claimed by other pirates. Locations marked in the map. Be careful if you're sunk again, it'll be lost forever. I mean, we just gotta go. I I'm hoping they're gone now. It should be right out here in front of us, right? This is our shipwreck. So we're gonna go back to our ship. Oh my God, they're right there. Why are they beating up on me? Why are they being mean to me? Did we get it? That's, that's all of our stuff. We already got it back, okay. I'm just gonna sit right here and I'm gonna wait for them to leave. I have no idea what that was about. But at least we found out what happens if you die. You know what? I'm just gonna fast travel across. It's gonna cost us 350 coin, but we're... We're gonna play it safe. We've got safe passage. Feel good about that. Let's get back at our ship. Let's set sail. There are crocs in this area too, so it, it's gonna work out well for us. If we hit the croc here, go left. This is a hammerhead, and then we can go into hippo territory. Perfect. All right. I mean, we have been messing around. Was that Fada that attacked us there? We have been messing around with them quite a bit, so I don't blame them for what they just did. I just didn't really expect it, especially we're in this little dinghy. I would like to be able to fend for myself if we can't. Ooh, this is going to be a secret area, isn't it? We've seen these before. Haven't been able to get into them because we weren't in the Dow. Oh, this is just like a little... If you were being chased by a bigger boat, you could go through here and get away from them. Is there anything of interest in here, though? I don't really see anything good. Crocs. Crikey! This is for Steve Irwin, baby. Got him. Too bad we aren't hunting uh, stingrays. That's where we would really get some payback for him. I'm going to take all this Oroko while we're in here. We probably could do a little bit of harvesting. I don't think we're going to be able to store much on this boat so we gotta be careful but we'll get what we can i guess i just don't understand why we were attacked the way we were because we don't have any you have like the the ranks up at the top right it like shows the flag and the the you know 
group that is upset with you at the moment because you attacked their base or attacked them or whatever. It shows you what level of, of aggression you're at, basically. And we haven't done anything, so I, I guess you could just randomly be attacked. There's some bad men out there that are going to take advantage of you if you let your guard down at all, so we got to be careful. We're coming around the bend here, though. We got some hammerheads in here. I'm going to try to take on as many as, as we can. Obviously, we just need one of each, but you can turn the shark skin into materials. Same with the hippos and everything else. I'm sure we're going to need it eventually, so. Got a nice little hunting mission while we wait for Skurlock. Hammerhead up ahead. Kobe. Nope. Nope. Got him. Where'd he go? Did he really disappear? He ran from us. They might be a little tougher than anticipated. Grab some Oroko while we're here. This is just kind of like a stoke the uh, the barracks mission, I guess. Another one. Oh, this is going to be a big boy, isn't it? Get him. He looks, he looks big. He looks angry. Come on. Trev, you haven't hit him yet? Like, at all? Hello? There it is. Don't let him get away this time. Got him. There it is. I will take that shark meat and skin. Got another shark there. Two more shark meats, two more shark skins, and we're gonna be able to round this corner and go take on some hippos, the nastiest thing in the world. Probably the worst animal you could possibly run into out in the wild. We're on a very rinky-dink little boat here with a couple of spears. I don't know if this is the best idea, but I don't think we have any other options. You can't really fish for anything without the Dow, so just going to hope for the best here. Then the real problem is we're going to go through and then we're going to have to cross without dying to whoever has our number out there. I don't even know who it was, to be honest. Is that a hippo? There's a hippo. Should be a slightly larger target to hit, right? Got him. All right. Well, that's how you get it done. Keep your eyes out, fellas. We're looking for more hippos. Not going to make hunting a common thing that we do. So while we're out here, is that one right there? Maybe. Oh, got one out in the, out in the deep end. Get him. Get him, boys. Oh, he's coming at us. He's done. Nope. 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 There it is. So a hammerhead shark takes two, a hippo takes three. That is scary. Woo! The quick three piece right there. That's what I'm talking about. He gone. All right. I think that's all of them. Let's head back to port. Oh, a shark just attacked us while we were gathering wood, bro. What? Come on. One v one, you done, son? Is he dead yet? Nope. He's. He's stuck in the he's stuck in the sand. That's what you get. Thanks for the free meat. Now this is the problem. I don't know how we're gonna get it. There's, uh, we could have gone back to this sacred tree base and fast traveled over. Ah, oh, dude, I just don't know what to do. Let's pick this up as we go. We've got a whole boat full of stuff. I mean, we technically completed the the challenge, which is what we wanted. But I want all these hides and stuff because I want to turn it into the refinery and and. Break it down into like leather and whatever else we need. Is there anybody out here? Dude, look at that sunset. Oh my goodness, this game is so beautiful. We are just getting pile drive by the waves here. We gotta make it across. Just run, fellas. We got somebody off over there. I think we should be good. He's a little bit smaller. The big dogs look like they could be over there. I don't even think that's them. They could be on the other side of this island. Just hold it down, baby. We are going as fast as possible straight across. I think if we go to the left. Should be better. Is there anybody around this way? We're home free. Let's go. I think. Maybe. Starboard? I don't see anybody starboard. Far off in the distance. We're good to go. We'll take it. This is scary, dude. Imagine being on something this small. This little... What is this? Like a 25, 30 foot boat? Oh! I think somebody else is getting in a fight over there, so that honestly should keep some some heat off of us. But look at these waves. Like it, when you're when you're up here, they don't really look that big, but when you go down the first person, this is terrifying. Got another shark there. Can't even hit him. But we're in a safe zone now, so we should be okay. Let's go. All right. Well done. Mission accomplished. Present the trophies to the sea people in pa Oh, we've got to present them. Oops. Well, that's that's fine. So we've got all those trophies. We can take 
the skins and stuff to the old mill though. So this is what I was talking about. Hello. All right, we're good. How you doing? Good to see you. We don't have to talk every time I come back. But yeah, we can turn uh, crocodile leather into refined hides. We can make two of those. We can also make some hippo leather. We can make seven of those. We collect this hide here, and then we can provide some more. We can make some shark. Eight of those. Basic stuff. We're going to switch ships. We're going to get back at our cutter so we can stop getting bullied and at least kind of put up a bit of a fight in case we get anything. So we're... We're gonna have to sail to Palisade Bay, which is up here. We literally traveled right by. I, I didn't realize we had to deliver things, so that's my bad. I guess make sure you complete the mission before you commit to leaving the area. That was dumb. We literally just came through. We were chopping down trees, and that's where we ran across scared, and this is where we had to deliver it. So that's not a big deal. It happens. Finish this up, deliver. Get rid of all the teeth. Got 600 silver for that. That's what I'm talking about. All right. I think Skurlock's ready for us. Let's go back and talk to him. Oh, let's go, baby. We got four people on a level eight ship. I'll join in. Let's get after him. Y'all came to the wrong hood. You were bullying me earlier. Now I got backup now, huh? We got to be careful here, Trev. Fire muskets. Get the muskets on them. Let's go. We got three guys on them. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Y'all thought we got you cornered now. Switch to the left side, slow it down a little bit. We can hit him here. Beautiful. Dude, this is epic. The fact that we have other human players here that are just getting it. Let's go. Got him there. Oop. We're fine. Hit him with the right side. Another one right there. Come on. I feel like our friends here are not doing all that much damage. Oh. Rulesy. No. From downtown. Got him. From downtown. That's a money shot. Almost. Come on. One more. Let me get the final kill. Let's go. All right. Nice job. Rulesy and... Oh, Klein. He helped us out earlier. We got another level eight. We taking on this level eight or are we running? What do you think, boys? We want to take on the level eight? I feel like maybe this is a bad idea, Trev. Especially because our boys are weak. All right. We're going to run. Let's just tie tail it. Rulesy's out. I'm out. We roll together. Dude, what a moment. The fact that we're just, we're traveling back, chilling. I'm not even like really paying attention. All of a sudden we got a big battle going on. We got 50 notoriety. What is it called? Fame? Something. Not even sure. Infamy. Yeah, we got to level up, man. I think next episode, the focus is going to be on the new ship. I think we really need it. We're just not quite cut out for the battles with those guys currently. But we can duck into the safe zone. They can't mess with us anymore. And let's go talk to Skrillex. Buy me. Fools. I'm no man. Best not head in there. The boss man's piss drunk off fine wines. Nearly shot me with his flint lock earlier. Sounds like a good Other time. Feelings he did. I am the king. I am John Sherlock. I'm, I'm Scott Sherlock. That wine, meant for the crew, mind you, was part of a hefty downpour. Some scheming French turncoats want to make a violent power grab for the regional office. So they hired Skurlock and his, uh, persuasive ways to attack the Compagnie Royale Fort. Margareta, please. In this state, he couldn't steer a ship even if his dear old Margareta came calling. So we're going to have to take care of it. Uh, we're in a pickle now. If we don't deliver on the gig, Skurlock's reputation will be in tatters. Only there was someone skilled enough to pass as him and helm his ship. We get access to his ship? The Devil's Gambit. A lost shipment threatens to unravel Skurlock's relations with Tuling and his grip on business in the Red Isle. Execute the scheme devised by Skurlock's guards to recover the lost New York shipment. I'm down. 500 infamy on this thing and we get a new ship? Visit the Atelier to disguise yourself as Sherlock. We're going to put his jacket on. Perfect. Well, I'll be. What are the odds? You look about Skurlock's size and disposition, maybe not as raffish, but there's a chance you could pull it off. But first, you'll need to look the part of a kingpin. Here, take these spare garbs from Skurlock's wardrobe. Don't worry, it's fair game. If he takes our wine, we'll take his clothes. <laughs> Once you're all dressed up, head out to where the ship's berthed. I'll make sure the crew's in on the plan. 
I made it to see you, Mark. <laughs> what would Go on then. Say? He's going to have a rough night. Sobers up and don't fuck this up. We'll be our edge that roll. All right. I love this, man. Like the, the whole being tricky and dressing up as your enemy and now pretending like we're Skurlock because he's drunk and we got to still make sure the job gets done like this. This is getting interesting. We got a bit of a storyline happening. as the way you dress. So we're going to equip his jacket. I think it's it's about time that we put something new on too. Obviously, this is not going to be Defiant Eye Patch. Which ones are Skurlocks? I think we just want his jacket, right? Fabled coat. Jacket of infamy? Skurlocks jacket right here. We'll throw that on. I think we're going to change up our look afterwards too. So we'll I just I hate all the new things. I'm going to take all these off. But we'll switch things up uh We'll switch things up in the next episode. Oh shoot, I missed one piece of equipment. I wish there was a get rid of all new button. Oh my gosh, all right, I'm, I'll see you guys in a sec. Check out the new digs, baby. That's what I'm talking about. No longer a lowly scurvy man. I don't know what to call a low pirate. Kind of looking the part of a kingpin here. I like it, all right. So we uh, sail to the Commander Skurlock's ship, the Margareta. Let's do it. We're going to be able to make it through this bridge. This seems like a bit of a tight fit. We got to go through here and then his ship's going to be over in this area. He hasn't really seen the dirty side of war in a while. He sits up there in his office and commands his troops, which I guess is kind of the, the goal as a pirate. You don't always want to be getting your hands dirty, but I would imagine from time to time it wouldn't be bad. Is that her? Look at that. Oh, we got a little shipwreck over here, too. I don't think we've been to this side. This is like our home aisle, but we haven't been over here. So let's see if we can grab this really quick. Just kidding. I think we have grabbed that before. So I guess we have been here. I lied. I'm a pirate, though. It's all right. You can. There she is. What a beaut. Honestly, does it look as insane as I thought it was going to be? But we'll take it. Got some lions on the side. Okay, this thing is pretty cool. So we're going to pose as him, and we're going to go plunder Fort Delis, which is a stage four fort. Is it over here? Right here. Fort Delis. In a new area we haven't been to, starting to go a little bit east. Not too far, but it actually looks like it might be right there. Now, we have his his setup, so we, we got to be careful about that. We've got um, 1,000 cannonballs, 350 bombard bombs, restoration kit, only two repair kits. And then some food. So we're gonna be careful. It looks like we've got what is what are those on the front? I'm not even sure. What in the world? Fort Delis. I mean this feels like maybe a bad idea, but we'll see what happens. I don't know his ship, I don't know his weapons, I don't know what he's got. Plunder starts. Let's get after it. I think we're we're aiming at the towers. We might want to get moving here, Trev. There it is. Those are better. Come on, baby. Be careful. He has a level 9 ship, dude. This thing is a beast. Okay, what? This is just the shotgun, right? There it is. I mean... If we slow it down... The thing is, we're too... A little bit. Oh, let's go. Okay, you know what? I might just use this front cannon. This is the best thing by far. My goodness. Just keep rocketing here. Just switch back and forth. Bing, bang, boom. Easy peasy. Let them reload. I'm sure they're going to have some reinforcements come at some point, but hopefully most of the castle is down by then. One more shot there. Should do it. We got the big guy up top there. You don't even have to hit it all the way up on the top. I thought you would have to hit like the, the peak of it, but you can just, you can just take it down like this. Oh, hello. You a bad guy? You're a bad guy, aren't you? <laughs> Bro, level nine ship. We're gonna watch our, our health a little bit, I think. We're still in good shape though. Trying to take down the top thing up there. There it is, she's down. Got some loot. We got another tower over here we're gonna want to take on. So let's, I say we just finish this to start. Get far enough away that we can hit it at the angle that we want and then we can just go to work. Dude, whatever that is, is ridiculous. It's like a 
50 shot at the same time type thing. So we would keep attacking the walls, I think. These guys have a lot of armor. Let's hit their weak spot. Fire your muskets. Beautiful. We're about a quarter health down, which isn't terrible. Just keep focusing on the weak spots. Up close and personal. Get them to half and then we can crew board them. Take them down easy. So this is this is like big money business here. This is when you're when you're top dog and you got plenty of firepower, this is what it looks like. Coming in, just soloing an entire base. Enemies can't do a thing. Finish them there, beautiful. We got another one right here in front of us. I'm gonna use a repair kit. Do a little crew boarding, he's done. There it is, nicely executed. We do have to be careful, that repair kit did not fix as much as I was hoping it was going to. I don't know what it wants us to hit. It looks like there's a tower. Is it the tower over on the left? Oh, that's it. Or is it this? Is it this? It's that. Okay, my bad. Just hit it with this. We'll be good. A couple of these. Then from the side. Then back to a couple of these. We're going to break down this wall. Got some little ships that decided to come party. I'm going to... Maybe think about using another... Repair kit. Try to help us out. Alright, we're almost there. We just need to stay in the area. They're calling for more reinforcements. I don't think there's anything else in the walls we can shoot. We got more ships coming in. These things shoot a little bit straighter than what we're used to. I think these are bombard cannons too. My bad. Kind of messed that up. Get up close and personal. Hit him with two of those. Hit him with that. Fire the muskets. They should be just about down. He's done. We got this one over here. Hit him with that. Turn and hit him with our bombard bomb. So those shoot way straighter than ours. I love that. We need to get that. He's going to come at us. Not going to happen, man. Might as well crew board him. Get the extra loot. Or just let him die. We got more guys coming in. Try to hit him from a distance. Missed him, but we're fine. This is the last... The last stand, I think. Use some more of our repair kits. I don't think we're really going to need it, though. Where are they going? They're staying on the other side of the island. I'll go get you guys then. Dude, this thing is sick. Look at the size of this ship. This is what we're going to try to get for the next episode. I don't know if we're going to be able to get one this big. I don't know what kind this is, but we're going to do our best. Get him there. Get him there. Get him there. There it is. Good, good connection. Got one over here. I'm gonna swoop around the island. We're gonna grab him again. We swing around this way. Get him with this gun. Oh, we missed that? And then hit him with the side. There it is. Fire muskets, they should be dead. Not quite, but we can hit him with our rear cannons. Not even sure what this does, but we'll hit him with it. Really the least effective cannons that we have. These things are not, are not doing much. That'll do it though. Done. And now we've got these guys here, which should be no problem at all. A couple more bombards. And that, my friends, is a GG. Oh, it didn't kill him? We'll finish him here. One, two. And if we turn to the side. Boom. Let's go. Plunder complete, baby. I mean, that was... 10 ships and a whole ass base coming for us. We've got a level 9 ship here just absolutely decimated everything. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go grab our loot for a job well done. Cap is back at base, drinking, having a jolly old time, and we took care of business for him. That was good. That was OP. I will take charge of this ship at any time. All right, looks like we're gonna sail back home. We've got four stars up there in the top right too, or full four skull and crossbones. I mean, we could, if we wanted to, maybe sail around and take some other stuff out, but I also think that might fail our mission, so I'm not gonna do anything crazy. This is great, though. This is insane. Look at the height of this thing to be able to see over islands, see what you wanna take on. If they're literally in our wheelhouse, I'm gonna go, oh, no, we aren't, no, we aren't, no, we aren't, no, we aren't. Stay in the area. See, that's what I'm talking about. Can we shoot them from outside? We can. I'm not gonna go out there, but I will, I will kill him.
I mean, I don't... Did that get us what we wanted there? I'm not sure. I don't want to fail this mission, though. That was that was a lot. So let's just take old girl back home. We're not going to take her for a joyride. We're going to switch back to our ship and report back to his guards. God, that thing was a beast. It's double the size of our ship. We need something better. I do love this thing, though. The grass is always greener. You can't be too upset about it. This thing has treated us so well. And the fact that we're always healing is pretty good. But yeah, I, I think next episode we're going to... If we can get up to Buccaneer or whatever we need, I think that's going to be our, our goal, is we're going to try to get a more offensively-minded ship. So I'm well done. Company full up in flames. They say the fires can be seen all the way from the Red Isle. Got the whole of St. Anne talking about what Skurlock's done. Oh, well, what you've done, that stays between us. You know, you look to Ryan natural out there in Skurlock's boots. Could see you growing into a pair of your own someday. Skurlock's reputation is safe, and our little French turncoats are satisfied. What a world we live in, eh? Doesn't matter whether you're a pirate or a prefect, you stab someone in the back just for a shot of glory and gain. <laughs> Fine work, anyhow. The boss man's sobered up, and he's already plotting to strike further into the heart of Compagnie territory. I'm sure he'll want to share these plans with you. So head inside when you're ready. Who knows? Skurlock might even share some of the wine this time. Man. I've got other business to attend to. I think that's a good spot to end this episode. I'm going to try to do some side missions and stuff and work up and get some sort of a better ship. So, oh, did did we? Were we a buccaneer before? No, we, we, we need to get past this. So we need like... 700 more points. I'm just going to do a couple side missions. I'm going to get us ready to, to build a new ship in the next episode and uh, that we could take on the next Skurlock missions and, and beyond. If I'm being honest, Skurlock seems like a, a bit of a phony? I don't know. I, he obviously has a story behind him and he, he made his way to this spot, but if all he's doing is sitting on his loins and drinking and enjoying the fruits of his previous labor, eventually somebody's going to pass him and that somebody may be us. I think we might be coming for his neck. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you guys are enjoying. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out.